today we've got another trailer reaction for you guys and the wait is finally over to watch the new Spider-Man No Way Home trailer. Now, I don't know if any of you guys watched the trailer that leaked, but this one hopefully will exceed anybody's expectations because this movie is definitely one of my most anticipated movies of the year, so I am hoping to not be disappointed. I already heard there's a lot of reveals in the trailer, or some reveals, but uh, certainly a lot of fans are excited about this movie. So without any further ado, let's roll this trailer. Oh, look at this. This is a good one. Some suggest that Parker's powers include the male spider's ability to hypnotize females. Stop. Come on. Yes, my spider lord. <laughs> We just like stay up here all day. It is so crazy down there. <laughs> That's right, folks. Spider Man is in fact Peter Parker. I love the JK Simpsons is back as J. Jonah Jameson. The drones did. The drones that are yours. Oh, who's that? Does any part of you feel relieved about all this? What do you mean? Now that everybody knows, you don't really have to hide or lie to people. For the record, I never wanted to lie to you. Ruth, how do you tell someone that you're Spider Man? Now everybody knows. But this isn't about me. This is hurting a lot of people. I've just been thinking about how to fix all of this. Mm. So, Peter, you walked away all the pleasure. I'm sorry to bother you, sir. Please, we saved half the universe together. I think we're beyond you calling me, sir. Okay, <laughs> Stephen. That feels weird, but I'll allow it. <laughs> when Mysterio revealed my identity, my entire life got screwed up. Mm -hmm. I was wondering if maybe you could make it so that he never did. Strange. Don't cast that spell. Oh. It's too dangerous. Fine. I won't. Yeah, we'll see about that. <laughs> the entire world is about to forget that Peter Parker is Spider-Man. Wait, everyone? Okay, some people still know. That's not how the spell works. So MJ's going to forget about everything we've ever been through? Stop tampering with the spell. Oh my god, Ned. He's my best friend. Bro, my Aunt May should really know. Stop talking. Uh-oh. Oh. What just happened? He screwed up the spell. <laughs> tampering with the stability of space-time. The multiverse is a concept about which we know frighteningly little. The big... Ah! Trying to live two different lives. The longer you do it, the more dangerous it becomes. <laughs> ah, the goblin. Be careful what you wish for, Parker. Hello, Peter. <laughs> no, I love that. <laughs> Oh wow. Woo! So, wow. <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> oh wow, that was amazing. <laughs> okay, so imagine a world where everyone forgot that Peter Parker was not Spider Man. Now, I actually didn't end up reviewing the last Spider-Man movie, Spider-Man Far From Home, and obviously in this movie it's sort of basing it off of the fallout from that movie where Jake Gyllenhaal's character who played Mysterio and he revealed that Peter Parker was Spider-Man, but now Spider-Man is trying to seek the help from Doctor Strange, played by Benedict Cumberbatch, to sort of create a spell to make sure that everybody forgot that that was revealed, but that opens up the multiverse. And since we knew that there were going to be some possible cameos from previous Spider-Man actors like Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield. You, for now, have only some of the villains from those movies in 
this trailer. First off, I love the reveal of Doc Ock, who is played by Alfred Molina, and he's returning in this movie. I just think he looks so cool, so I can't wait to see him. But obviously a lot of fans are probably excited to see Willem Dafoe's Green Goblin return, and if you probably caught it, uh, you can see a little bit of a spark happening in the trailer, and that is because Jamie Foxx's Electro from the Andrew Garfield Spider-Man movie is going to be in this movie, and he's not going to be sporting that blue hue that we saw, but now he's going to be yellow. And also, I'm pretty sure that they might have teased a Charlie Cox as Matt Murdock, aka Daredevil in this movie. I'm not too sure, but a lot of people were thinking that that was the case. But also, I love seeing that J.K. Simmons, J. Jonah Jameson uh, cameo as well. So it just all sort of brings everything full circle. So I think it'll be really interesting to see, you know, how this is all going to transpire because I was a huge fan of the Spider-Man uh, into the Spider-Verse animated movie, but now seeing uh, a live action version of the multiverse playing out here, I think would be pretty awesome to see how it's all gonna play out because I mean, it's like, it's never been done before, but I hope that it gets pulled off really well. So I'm just really looking forward to seeing this movie and seeing <laughs> what else could possibly happen or even go wrong but in a good way because uh basically dr strange is in trouble but also peter parker caused this to sort of happen so i don't know what's gonna happen but it still makes me even more excited to see this movie when it comes out this december so i can't wait to see it in theaters so let me know in the comments what you guys think of the Spider-Man No Way Home trailer and if you're looking forward to seeing this movie and what was your favorite shot from the trailer. And as always, you guys can subscribe to my channel. I've got movie reviews, movie updates. Come back every week for a Chill Thursday video. You guys can also like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. And I'll see you guys later.